Hey, Claude. Looks like you had another one of those meetings. You finally finished? For today, yeah. But we're picking up right where we left off tomorrow. <sighs> That's a lot of talking. What could possibly call for that much discussion? Well, first, we need to settle on a direction for the Alliance. And then come all the pesky little details. All responsibilities need to be doled out fairly, but each territory has different resources and different circumstances, you know? So it's tricky to figure out what's really fair. There's no one answer that works across the board. But you're their leader. Can't you just make a bunch of decisions and get it over with? No can do, I'm afraid. I may be the leader, but I'm still just one of the five great lords. Sure, I may be the idea man, but I don't have the authority to enforce anything on my own. On top of all that, most nobles are experts at focusing on what's good for their own territory instead of what would benefit the Alliance as a whole. When priorities clash, the debates just go around and around in endless circles. Makes me wonder if we'll ever reach a consensus on anything. Hold on. Do you really think you'll win the war like this? You'll always be on the defensive if you can't act decisively. I hear you, believe me. The process works much better in times of peace. But since we're at war, it's frustrating to say the least. What's worse is that it's near impossible to get a read on the situation. I don't have the foggiest idea how we're going to overcome this. Say, mind if I pick your brain? What would you do in my shoes? What, me? Well, I guess I'd... Just hit him with the old ba-bam, you know? That's the way. Ba-bam, right. Think you could elaborate on that a little? What I'm saying is, why not just get rid of all the talking? You mean, get rid of the Alliance's council altogether? Exactly. If you give yourself more authority, then it won't take as long to make decisions. It doesn't even have to be permanent. You could go back to the old way once things are peaceful again. But I guess that wouldn't go over too well with the other nobles, huh? Actually, I think you're onto something. Can't say it hasn't crossed my mind before. If folks at the round table just keep looking out for their own territory's interests, We'll be in a world of hurt if the Alliance is ever invaded. I just wish they could see that. Whoa, are you seriously considering it, Claude? Of course. Unfortunately, the possibility of it actually happening right now is basically zero. But you've given me a lot to chew on. Let's do this again sometime. Just say the word. <laughs>